Hello everyone. Today we're going to be making sensory bags. They're lots of fun and can be really interesting and engaging for the children. I've got a couple here for you to see. This one is with paint and glitter. It's confetti glitter and it does lots of things that you can move it around. And then I've also got another one here that is just all glitter and you can chase the glitter around the pouch. So I'm going to show you how you can make your own sensory bags at home. First off you'll need a sealer and I've got one here and to go with the sealer you need the proper sealing bags and you can buy these to go with the sealer so what we do is we cut off around about 15 20 centimeters in depth plastic and then we're going to seal it up so we'll do first the one end so we open up our sealer we pop it in here making sure that you're following the instructions right up to the line and then you close it up hear the click and let's go now the sealer has the option to do a wet seal so because we're going to put some oil or some gel in here it would be best to do the wet seal the lights are on and it's going through we just need to wait for those to come off. There we go. Uh, we can open it back up again. And look at that. We've got a lovely seal on our bag. So what we need to do now is decide what we're going to put in it. So what I've got here is I'm going to show you how to do one of the ones I've already made. So you want to get your confetti glitter. that in nice dollop let's put the lid back on there and I've been using baby oil but you can use also hair gel normal oil just to pop it in there and give it some liquid so that the confetti can move around good dollop again Here's my baby oil. There's my confetti. And so here we go. We've got the baby oil and the confetti in our pouch. And what we need to do is seal it again. So we're going to pop it back in. And close it up we need to hear the click again click and then we do again our wet seal and our heat and then as you can see the two lights are on and we'll just wait for those to finish and we'll see what we've got after I've done this one I will show you another one where we can uh, use things that we find in the garden. So we're going to do some seeds from a fennel plant. Lights have gone out. Click it open. It's sealed again. And there we go. We just need to get the scissors and trim it. Lovely. Something for your children to play with at home. A lovely sensory bag. So just get the scissors trim the excess plastic off don't cut too closely to the seal and there we go we've got a sensory bag 